Hey guys, this is Seth for FameAdvantage.com and this is your Sundays with Seth Hill segment. So first of all, yesterday, uh, on Saturday, I went to a tournament. Uh, I went to the Valley Stream Monster number one tournament in Long Island and I had a great time. We And I recorded a bunch of great footage. Uh, I recorded only the top four of every tournament. There were four tournaments though. So uh, I've already posted Ultimate Mortal Kombat, but upcoming are Super Street Fighter 4, Marvel Com Mortal Kombat 9, and Marvel vs. Capcom 3. So um, I'm going to be doing what I usually do with the tournament match footage and kind of space them out during the week. But if you do want to see them all early, before they're up on YouTube, you can go to frame-advantage.com, just go to this website, and they're all actually already up there right now. You would also know this if you were uh, friends with me on Facebook at facebook.com slash or fans of frameadvantage.com on Facebook, facebook.com slash frameadvantage, or if you're following me on Twitter at twitter.com slash fadc. Just a heads up so you guys know where to go for all the latest and greatest of my coverage of the fighting game scene. Now, um, this will be the first of, uh, I mean, this will be the first time actually we've seen tournament first person commentary because Chris G actually, uh, Chris, first of all, Chris G was actually in the grand finals of every tournament there, so spoiler alert, and um, he actually had the other headset on while I was commentating on the matches. So we, I was actually speaking to Chris while he was playing the matches, and um, I, I'm not, he, he doesn't win every tournament, but um, he wins a good number, <laughs> and it's really fun to hear him, you know, hear him vent his frustration or talk about what he's trying to go for or whatever um, while he's playing the match. Um, you know, I, I kind of took this idea first with some commentary from Marvelous Mondays and just said, you know what, let's let's do it in tournament now. Uh, I know what you. I know what some of you guys may be thinking, and uh, we did explicitly ask every competitor um, that Chris G fought against to make sure that it was that they were cool with Chris G speaking on the mic while he was playing their match. And um, they're just speaking. They were all okay with it. This is not really at all meant to disrespect the players in any way, but it was all about um, just trying to get into what Chris G is about. You know what he's thinking, how he's how he's approaching matches and stuff like that. And uh, I think it's interesting, especially because there isn't so much uh, commentary and so, or very much footage at all about Chris in general. And uh, he's really turning out to be one of the best players on the East Coast uh, recently. So uh, you guys, that'll be going up on YouTube this week. And if you want to see it early, then head over to the website. The website's awesome because it has a whole bunch of other stuff too on it. But we'll get into that later. Um, so... Uh, Something I mentioned in Super Turbo Saturday is that uh, I kind of alluded to as well here is that I'm moving away. I, I'm actually moving away at the end of this month. So um, I'll record a video before leaving to um, to Ultimate Fighting Game Tournament, Ultimate Fighting Game Tournament Seven, and um, I'm going to spend Memorial Day weekend in Chicago um, filming a whole bunch of footage there along with Level Up Series, who will be running the stream there. And then um, during that following week, I'm going to be uh, moving out of the state. So, in terms of um, my covering the East Coast scene, obviously it's gonna things will be changing in the future. Just because um, I'm not gonna be I'm not gonna be living in New York anymore. <laughs> um, you know, that's just uh, that's just kind of how things go. Um, it, I I found a I found a really awesome opportunity that I'll talk to you guys more about in the future. But I really just could not turn it down, and uh, I've actually honestly been kind of getting tired of New York. I don't know how, how many of you guys noticed this or what, but I, I was born and raised in the West Coast, and I'm really a California kind of person. Like, every person I meet in New York, actually, they always ask me right away, like, oh, you're not from around here, are you? I, I don't really feel like um, I fit in so much here, and I, it's kind of weird because um, over the past couple of years, I, I've been kind of, you know, uh, like, a part of this, you know, representing the East Coast vibe, uh, representing, representing the East Coast thing, and I'm, I'm not really an East Coast guy, I mean, at this point, I'm, I don't, I'm not, I don't really belong anywhere, <laughs> I don't really know many of the people on the West Coast scene or anything like that, but, um, I will be moving, um, uh, and I'll, I will continue, I will continue to make videos and stuff, uh, in terms of the, the match footage and stuff like that, I kind of tried to start making stuff that was, you know, apart from like the general, you know, tournament, weekend tournament match videos, just because I knew that I wasn't going to be able to keep that up the whole time, and, um, and my suspicions were confirmed, I'm, I'm leaving the city, and we'll see uh, what happens to FameAdvantage.com after that. Um, honestly, I can't really make any promises right now because I don't know. <laughs> But uh, I will promise you one thing. A lot of people have been asking you, uh, asking me 
for the soundtrack to all these videos. Like, post the beat somewhere here and there. And I'll tell you what, man. If it was up to me, I would have posted those months ago. Like, <laughs> so much earlier. But the thing is, uh, Jibbo, who writes all these tracks for me, including the one that's playing now, um, demanded me to hold off, hold off, hold off. Uh, you know, let him make it better. Let him, let him refine things, remix things, and make it like a complete package. So, um, the album will be going on sale. The FrameAdvantage.com soundtrack will be going on sale at FrameAdvantage.com on June 1st. I gave Jibbo that deadline. I was like, I can't wait any longer than this. <laughs> People have been waiting for a long time already, and I'm sick and tired of getting messages about please post this beat, where can I get this beat, all this stuff. I, I, just, stopped, I just stopped responding to them because like, I didn't really know what Jibbo would be freaking ready with them. But, uh, you know, he's... Um, He's in the Air Force and he's deployed currently, um, and he's just spending every ounce of his free time making uh, making these making these beats and stuff for me, and, and they're awesome. He's really talented, and I'm really excited to I'm really excited to unveil to you guys like the kind of stuff that he's been working on. If you guys find him on Twitter, on Facebook, and stuff like that, then you guys will be able to get sneak peeks on it. But in any way, in any case, on June 1st, FrameAdvantage.com soundtrack with. Oh, with way more songs than what you guys just hear on my videos, trust me. I, I know I just repeat the same songs over and over, there's gonna be a lot more stuff on this, on, on, on that track, on that soundtrack. Um, that's all I'll tell you guys about the store for now, but there are other things coming to it too, which are gonna be really cool also. But yeah, um, so that's about it, I think. Oh, oh, so um, yeah, I've, I've, not been, I've not been posting much video lately, and that's just because, dude, man, I'm, I'm trying to like pick up, like pick up all my life and package it up, and you know, tie things up, I'll tie things up everywhere, like frameadvantage.com and at work and like everything. Try to set up everything, package it up nicely, so I could move halfway across the country or whatever. My God, you gotta cut me a break, man. I was able to uh, devote one entire day yesterday to go uh, get some match footage, and it's really funny. Please go to the website, and check it out. But um, oof, man. So on that note, um. Marvelous Mondays. Uh, I'm really glad that you guys enjoyed, enjoyed the last episode of Marvelous Mondays, um, and it, it might very well be the last one because, like, honestly, I tried twice now to uh, to go to like set up with Empire to to get another whatever um, to get another recording session going, and these guys they just they just screwed up scheduling and everything like twice now. You know, I live in Jersey, so I go through Manhattan and I go deep into Brooklyn to like meet with these guys, and they just don't show up. It's, ridiculous. It's such a waste of my time and um, honestly at this point uh, with with my entire life changing like I can't be asked to, to fucking chase these guys. Seriously. I know you guys like the videos. I really like the videos too. I mean that's why I make them because I like them. But it's really really frustrating when people are just irresponsible and just can't be counted on and um, you know, I really wish that it was entertaining for you guys to just watch me play things, because I'd be, I, I'd be able to make so much video of that. But my, uh, my having to travel and stuff to, uh, to get, to get this kind of footage just makes it impossible sometimes. Um, but anyway, there will be new videos this week, <laughs> and uh, I'll, I'll get you guys more information about um, what FrameAdvantage.com has in the future later on. So I'll see you guys next week.